Hi, I'm Jimmy, and today I'm going to review this Boscom OBD2 scanner. It was sent to me so I could review it, but all opinions are my own. Um, it doesn't appear to have a power switch on it, so I'm going to plug it into USB so I can update it. The company wanted me to show you how to update it, so that's what I'm going to do right now. Power's on. Go down to update. Try it over Wi-Fi. Searching for Wi-Fi. I've already put my password in. Connecting to Wi-Fi it says connecting to server. Um, I'm not going to do these ones yet. But I do want to add Toyota because that's what I have. So go down, push the function and then push OK to update. Now it says update complete. So let's go plug it into the truck and see if it can read my codes. So the first thing I had to do is make the check engine light come on. So I unplugged the sensor to the air intake. So let's plug in the connector into the port. Turn the key back on, powered on. Let's see if we can read some codes. Go here to diagnose. Asian, I have a Toyota. Toyota. Auto scan. It's a North American, it's a Tundra 2007. System, powertrain, engine and ECT. Read the trouble codes. All kinds of mass airflow sensor codes. So let's plug it back in and see if we can clear the codes. Turn the key back on. Check engine light's still on, let's see if we can clear it. Erase all the fault codes. Fault codes erased successfully. Let's turn the truck off and see if the check engine light's still there. Check engine light's off. All in all, this seems like a really great scanner and I'd highly recommend it to anybody.